consider the following situation uh, for three years year one two three three year treasury rate and and treasury spot rate have been given for a bond with a face value of dollar 100 and which pays eight eight percent annual coupon with a maturity period of three years the current market value based on the arbitrage free valuation is equal to so the payment that is going to be received in first year is equal to dollar eight because eight percent annual coupon on hundred dollars will amount to dollar eight the second year it will be dollar eight and the third year it will be dollar one zero eight. Now, based on the arbitrage free valuation, the market value of the bond will be equal to summation of the payment in each year in in the ith year divided by one plus treasury spot rate. Let's say this uh, treasury spot rate raised to the power of i. So the for the first year the present value will be dollar eight divided by one point zero six. For the second year it will be dollar eight divided by one point zero seven whole square. Remember we are using the treasury spot rate to get the present market value of the bond. We are not using the the uh, three year treasury rate. Rather we are using the treasury spot rate. And the third payment will give me the present value of dollar one zero eight divided by one point zero eight cube so if I sum all these three I will get the present market value of the bond based on the arbitrage free valuation is equal to one hundred point two seven so the correct option is option a if the market value of the bond is greater than one hundred point two seven then an investor will purchase the pieces and sell the sell and and make it a bond and sell it thus earning an profit however if the market value of the bond is less than 100.27 then the investor will earn will purchase a bond and sell it its pieces and hence it will earn a arbitrage profit so the so based on the arbitrage free valuation i mean which which means that there is no mispricing or there is no opportunity for arbit any kind of arbitrage the value of the market value of the bond will be the present value of the future cash flows divided by the treasury spot spot rates so in this case the correct answer is 100 dollar 100.27